Hi, I'm Mr. Corpra. We're going to play Family Feud Oakdale High School Edition. I asked all the Oakdale students and staff and admin a couple of Christmas questions, and now we're going to have my teams in digital communications play the game. They have not seen the answers. They are actually playing the game, uh, and we're going to see how it goes. All right, so let's play some Family Feud. All right? We need a first, uh, first people. Yes, Maggie. Phil, come on up here. You're going to face each other. Great. And so you're going to start with your, both of your hands behind your back, right? And then the first person to tap the thing. We asked Oakdale students and staff this question. If you think you know the answer, just tap the chair or the stool. Here we go. What is Oakdale's favorite Christmas movie? Yes. Polar Express. Is Polar Express up there? It is for number six. Okay, so can you think of a movie that would be more popular than Polar Express for the steel? Uh, like the, like the Vank and Bass, like Puppet, I don't know, like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. We going Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer? Yeah. All right, is Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer up there? Uh, no, so you get to keep it. Do you want to uh, play or pass? All right, we're gonna play. Here we go. So we're gonna head over here. Very good. You got. You can head on back there. All right. So, Oakdale's favorite Christmas movie. What do you think? Elf. Elf is Elf up there. Ooh, number one answer. Very good. Okay. Favorite Christmas movie, Tony. Home Alone. Home Alone is Home Alone up there. Yes, it is. Number two. Very good. All right. Favorite Christmas movie. I'm gonna get this wrong. Um, <laughs> The Grinch. Is Grinch up there? Number three, very good. All right, Ronnie, here we go. Claws. Claws. No, Claws is not up there for their first first uh, blank here. All right, here we go. Mag, what do you think? Oh, uh, Christmas Story. Christmas Story, is Christmas Story up there? No, Christmas Story. People did submit Christmas Story, but it wasn't the top seven. Yeah, and they submitted Claws, but it wasn't the top seven. Here we go. One uh, more. Oh, get ready for the steal, guys. You could discuss amongst yourselves here. If she doesn't get it, you get a guess. Oh, shoot. Christmas Vacation? Is that a movie? Christmas Vacation is yeah. a movie. Christmas Vacation. <gasps> oh, number five. Very good. We only got two left. All right, Tiny, here we go. Christmas Chronicles. Christmas Chronicles. Oh, no. Christmas Chronicles is not there, so we get to go over to Team B for the steal. Someone did submit Christmas Chronicles, but I think only one person. Here we go. All right. Guys, we're all, we all thought about it. All right, so no. what? <laughs> well, we need an answer. What do you say? The Santa Claus. The Santa Claus. Santa Claus is not up there, although people did submit it. Uh, so nice job. So that means the 87 points goes to Team A. Well done. Let's find out what the other two missing ones were. Num number seven, Nightmare Before Christmas. And, <laughs> and number four, Die hard. Uh, let's have Reagan, Lincoln, come on up. <laughs> Nicely done. Okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. Hands behind your back. <laughs> we asked Oakdale students and staff, what would you find on Christmas pajamas? Yes, Lincoln. Candy canes. Is candy canes up there? Yes, it is. Number six answer, though. So, can you think of one that a could... A Christmas tree. A Christmas trees. There we go. Christmas trees. So, are you going to pass or play? Play. All right, they're going to play. All right, guys. Okay, Nicole. Something you would find on Christmas pajamas. A reindeer? Is reindeer up there? Reindeer is up there. Number four. Good answer. All right. Get about Tandy. some snowflakes. Snowflakes. Yeah, number one answer. Snow or snowflakes was the number one answer. All right, Ronnie, here we go. Snowmen. Snowmen. <gasps> yes, indeed. All right, so that means there's only one answer left. Let's see if you can guess it. Go ahead. Santa. Santa up there. Oh, my goodness. Yes, they got all six answers, 100 points. Well done. Yay, nice job. Let's do one more round. Nicole, come on up. Who we got? Come on up, Justin. Okay. Now you have to get this to get some points on your side here, all right? We asked a bunch of Oakdale students, staff, and admin, what would be the most difficult thing to wrap in wrapping paper? 
Yes. A bicycle. A bicycle. Is bicycle up there? Number one answer. Very good. So, uh, Pat, you're going to play? Oh, okay. All right. Here we go. Oh, good. Team B gets to play. All right. Here we go. Uh, so you went, so now we're down here to Grace. All right, Grace. So what's something that would be very difficult to wrap in wrapping paper? A sports ball. A, a sports ball of some kind. Yeah. Hey, ball or basketball, nicely done. Okay, yeah, that was your answer. All right. Uh, yeah, go ahead, something difficult to wrap. I know this isn't right. A treadmill. A treadmill. <laughs> Okay, uh, no, I'm sorry, that was a good guess. Okay, here we go, B. What do you think? Something hard to wrap. Um, like, furniture. <laughs> what a good guess. Let's see if it's up there. Furniture is up there. All right, nice job. Let's get on back down here. Okay, something difficult to wrap here. A dog. A dog. Is a dog up there? Yes, pets. We got a lot of dogs and cats, um, which... Pretty terrible. Um, all right, for our last answer here, Lincoln. Oh man, he's stressed. What do we think? Uh, car. Car is a car up there? No, not a car. So Team B, get ready for or Team A, excuse me, get ready for a steal here. Okay, if we can't think this last answer, you ready? Here we go. Think about it. Is there a time limit? <laughs> a few seconds. You get a few seconds. You know what? A piano. A piano. Is piano up there? Oh, no. no. All right. Let's see if they can go for the steal. If they don't get it, then uh, you guys will get the 87 points. Have you guys discussed? Let's see. Come over here. Good. Good. Okay. You have to, you have to give the answer. You can all share with her. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, you got an answer. A television. A television. Is television on there? Television is not on there, which means Team B, you guys get uh, the 87 points. Nicely done. Let's, uh, let me come back here. Uh, let's find out what the last answer was. Uh, teddy bear or stuffed animals. Uh, well, that was Oakdale's Family Feud. Thanks for playing. It looks like, uh, oh yeah, all right, cool. We got uh, Team A, you guys are our winners today. Well done, yay. Thank you everybody for sending in their answers um, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great winter break. See you in January, bye. Bye. <laughs>